Chapter 11, 3-1, An Innocent Android. Come on, everyone, this way! <laughs> oh, pants like that, like, bah, 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 bah. We're out in days of fear. Leave us, save the children, and sad. Guys, Imperial is miles behind us. We got time to save everybody, so there's no need to start sacrificing your lives at this point. Shower with the Oh, I thought that red. <laughs> I thought you said, or I will shower with you. <laughs> really? You'll shower with me? Trust me, if there's a bad guy within 10 miles of this place, these souvenirs of mine would know about it. I doubt King Dave's crazy pie at first, but I gotta admit, it's working! I got excited until I read it properly. A few hours earlier. Shut the front door! You have bought a style spiff and run away? Like, separately? I think that's our best option. I mean, it seems Emil can issue commands directly to the androids, but he's the only one who can do so. So they, uh, you know, either move as one big unit or they have to stay put? Interesting. And that's why we're gonna split to two groups. If one of them serves as bait for the android forces, it will allow the second group to escape. Right, keep moving everybody! And don't worry, we'll protect you no matter what! I feel guilty we're making a sylvan like yourself protect us, a sylvan scum like you! I've heard the sylvan people have a deep loathing for humans! Not if you ask me! Hey, I got buttloads of boatloads <laughs> of human friends, plus some other races besides. Like, uh, you know, human and white people and Asian people, Chinese people and black people, you know, I don't know about Latino people. <laughs> oh, I'm totally joking. I'm kidding, kidding. Hey, jeez, Luca, what's wrong with you? I mean, who cares about doing things? Just because we happen to be Suman or Sylvan or whatever, that's boring. Me. Oh, what was that? Help me! Hey, you're the Andrew from before. <laughs> hey, I love Latino people. Do not get it twisted. It was Luca that said it, not me. <laughs> we got racist. Uh, ra Luca's a bit racist. Forgive him, please. They are the new master races. There are many humans over there who are injured and unable to move. I want to treat them, but of an android. I don't know enough about organic bodies. Please. Hey, look, I'd uh, love to help you out, but I'm already trying to evacuate all these folks, so. Who do you think I was talking? Oh, you see Gleo? Of course, so is a superior race. I guess so. Please, don't worry about us. If there are others who need your assistance, by all means, go to them now. Just leave us alone with your dirty sylvan hands. I don't wish to sound unappreci- Whoa, that's kind of- Unappreciative of your efforts, but if you have the chance to help others, you should do so and keep your filthy paws off of me. Well, when you put it like that, okay, android grandma, show me where all these wounded folks are hiding. <laughs> this grandma sounds like a grandpa. Thank you very much. Also, you may call me Mascula. I'm Luca. Wait a minute, Luca, Mascula? Well, we're pretty much brothers. I'm nice to meet you, I think. Still filling you out, so we'll save the handshake for later. Stallone is back. Whoa! Wait! Hang on! What's this angle? Mascula, these are Imperial soldiers! Are they the injured people you're trying to help? Yes, that's right. Is that a problem? Well, hell! I thought you were on their side, but I guess I was wrong! Your side? You clearly still work for the Empire if you want us to heal their wounded! Give me your wounded! That's a good worm print. No, that's not it. I'm not with the Empire. I am the Empire. Then why do you want me to help him? It's strange to help one who is injured. Oh, who's Laxy? Is it Laxy? Look, it's just... I read the... I don't understand. Why is this bad? 
Do you size me so much that you leave him a die? Uh, I don't want to hurt anyone. I seek only a help, without exception. Is that such a bad thing? No, of course not. Oh, damn it, fine. Whoa, when did Sonic curse all of a sudden? Look, I'll give him some of my silver medicine, okay? Oh, what kind of silver medicine you talking about? And don't mind me, uh, as I unloosen my belt, uh, that'll keep him from bleeding out or getting any kind of nasty rotten diseases. Sorry I had to go wasting the good stuff on a guy like me. The good stuff, give me that good silver stuff. Yeah, well, you can take this android for tip of my hand, I guess. Ah, uh, same old Luca. You're from the village. The Mir Mirage Lake, yeah? I remember you. Wait, how do you know that? I, 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 I saw you bathing in the lake. I saw your glistening body in the bright sun. My hometown so close to that village, so I know some of the folks there. Didn't stop me from joining the Imperial Army, though, did it? Didn't have much choice in the matter. If you're conscripted and refuse to serve, the Empire punishes your family. Yeah, uh, well, I guess even Imperial soldiers had their reasons. Thank you for the medicine, Luca. You're a good person. Actually, I should be thanking you. Why? For not being wrong and being right. Remember all that stuff you told me about life having value no matter whose side I'm having to be on? Yes, I remember. Well, maybe I needed a little reminder. Hell yeah, I was just going on about some villager about how race didn't matter, yet I turned around and did the same damn thing. Be my same racist damn self. So you opened my eyes to that. <laughs> you opened my eyes to the path of racism. To the sylvan power, so thanks. I... <laughs> Uh, I'm glad you understand. As I say, you're a good person. <laughs> These are the OG voices. Well, yeah, maybe I am, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna stop fighting. So that you gotta fight for what's right, for what's important, even if it means hurting someone else. All for the name of Sylvan Power, the Sylvan Master Race. I still believe there's a way to end conflicts without fighting. Yeah, maybe there is, but while we take the time to try to figure that out, most people, more people, are gonna suffer, you know? That's why I'm gonna keep fighting for what matters the most! For the... For the sustainability of the human... Not the human, sorry, the... <laughs> uh, and if you get in the way... I'll do what I gotta do. <laughs> Luca, I... Hey, guys, sorry to cut it, but I think you better get out real soon. We're left behind here. Since we we're injured, couldn't keep with our forces. The main Imperial Army won't be all that far. You should already get out of here. I know it's weird for me to be telling you this, but well, there it is. Yikes! Thanks, man. What's up, pal? Come on, everyone. We're leaving. Right! Take me with you! I'm the blame of the Imperial Army attacks, so I must protect you. I attack, I, pr uh, I defend, most importantly. I under uh, I do not yet. I could still be of assistance. I could take their weapons away from them, serve as a distraction to draw their eyes, or any number of things. What do you think? Man, you really are an oddball. Still, you seem okay for the most part. So if you want to tag along, feel free. <laughs> English, what could he was? <laughs> I knew you were a good person. Boy, you just say whatever pops in the old melon, huh? You ain't really used to folks who are like that. I don't know, uh, genuine or uh, childlike, maybe. Is being a child bad? Well, you know, I mean, we don't need to get into that. Well, that's fine. I mean, sure, it could be annoying sometimes. But like I said, you seem pretty all right. Pretty all right is an expression of favor, yes? I like you too, Luca. Uh, sure, Mascula, whatever you say, regardless, welcome aboard. Well, I was in before Luca X Mascula fanfic. Why are you there? Did you find them? Uh, yes, sir. They appear to be massing in the ruined vision down village down the way. Ha! They've been scattered about in an attempt to escape, but we've cornered them at last. Now I will see this settled. Chell called this thing a trump card, so if I use it. Hmm. Yes, this time I will crush them all. Crush. 
Dragalia fanfics. Oh boy.